And then lastly, we got to stand together because it's our time. And so Amos said it like this in the fifth chapter. Listen to this and I'm through. Amos said, listen, people hate this kind of talk because raw truth is never popular. But here it is bluntly spoken. This is verse 12 and 13. Because as a nation, you run roughshod over the poor and because you take bread right out of their mouths, I want to tell you as a nation, you will never move into your luxurious homes that you've built. And you're never going to drink in peace the wine at Marlego. I mean, the wine, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Every, the wine, let me read the text like it said, the wine from the expensive vineyards you planted. I know precisely the extent of your violations as a nation. I know the enormity of your sins, and it is appalling. You, the leaders of that time, you bully right-living people. You take bribes right and left, and you kick the poor when they're down. Some people began to think that justice is a lost cause, and evil is epidemic, and decent people are throwing up their hands, and some of them even said that protest and rebuke are useless and a waste of breath. But verse 14, but I need somebody. I need a group of people that will seek good and not evil and live. I need a group of people that will say to the nation, you keep talking about God bless you, God loves you. Well, act like it. Yeah. And the way a nation acts like it is verse 15, you hate evil and you love good. And then you work it out in public policy. And then maybe God will notice you. Verse 16 says, now I need a remnant. Because this nation is not going to do right on its own. So I need a remnant. Maybe I need 1,000 people in 25 states and 2,000 in Washington, D.C. I need a remnant that will go out and cry loudly and refuse to shut up until change comes. I need a remnant that will fill up the malls and the shops and warn the nation that it can't be who she claims to be until she does right by the poor and the least of these. I need a nation, a, 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 a group of people that will say, not me, not us, not now. I need a group of people that will empty the offices, empty the stores, this is in the Bible, empty the factories, empty the workplaces, and enlist everybody in a general lament until you make the nation hear. And God says, I want to hear you in the streets crying so loud over what's so wrong. And if you do, then I will make my visit.